This is Scott the Fix-It Guy. Today we're going to be working with a thin twin laundry center on accessing the washer components. These are such big machines that you don't really want to tilt them back. There's a way to pull out the washer components so they're really easy to work on. So first thing we got to make sure for safety's sake we unplug the machine. And next thing is we'll take off this front panel. It's already been removed right here, but there's just three screws holding it in. Here's the front panel. So we get that out of the way. And then we have some brass clips here we have to pry up. So we just use a standard head screwdriver, push in and push back, and it'll pop up that clip. And then on the other side, it's a little hard to get to, so I don't use a screwdriver. I just use a little piece of metal to pull that clip back. And then I can slide the whole front panel forward. So I remove those clips. I grab the front panel, pull it toward me, and it'll tend to catch on part of the fill system. So I'm gonna open up the lid, reach back and push down on this fill part spring loaded and that that allows me then to pull back further on the lid and remove it. I've already removed this nut that holds this spin basket in, in place. Now I'm going to remove the front panel. First I remove this screw that holds the support bar and once the screw is removed I just push the bar back out of the way. And then I'm going to remove a couple of screws in the front panel. One here on the left side and one on the right side. So I'm just going to push the basket out of the way so I can get to the screw. Here's the other side. And now this is underneath the machine with the panel removed. I've also already removed the motor. But I'm going to just now remove these two half-inch bolts, and they're, they're what's holding the washer assembly into the laundry center. So we're just going to remove those, and then we can actually slide the whole washing chassis out so we can access on all the washer components pretty easily. With the washer still connected to the laundry center, it's pretty impossible to get out the components. I'm just going to lift up on that drain tube and then I'll pull out the air pressure tube which is just connected here in the back. Just pull it straight up. We've already got our electrical connected from the motor so now we can pull the whole chassis forward and that will allow us to easily remove the spin basket <clears throat> or whatever other things you need to do. So to get this ring off, I'm just going to push down on the top to take the pressure off of these clips, and then I'll pull out on the clips. You got to go all the way around. But now that the chassis is pulled forward, it's really easy to get to these, these different parts. So just push down to take the pressure off, and then pull back on the clip. Pull that out, and then you can just pull the spin basket out at this point. So that's how we access these components, and it's actually pretty easy to do. So thanks a lot for watching, and please subscribe to our channel when you get a chance. Thank you.